Well, number one, I think the client needs to be open to change. If the client's not open to change, then coaching will never work for you. Okay. And, and numerous times, you know, I deal with clients and doing it 30 years, I've seen everything. Okay. And I think what's most intrinsic is being open folks to change. Okay. Cause you know, what, it, what is the saying? If keep doing what you're doing and expect different results, that's the definition of insanity. So sometimes we need to blow up the model and say it's not working anymore. Okay, are you open to that? Are you open to blowing up the model and looking at different ways to achieve the ultimate processes helping you achieve your goals? But if what you're doing is not working, are you willing to blow it up and start over? Now, starting over is scary for some people. Bob, I'm selling $100 million a year. Why would I blow it up? Are you achieving your goals, your aspirations, and your dreams? What's your work-life balance look like? Folks, your know, volume is one thing, but at the end of the day, it still has to come down to work-life balance. And if you're not open to work-life balance, then we're not the company for you. But I'll tell you, at the end of the day, if you're not open to work-life balance, then why are you doing this? If you just want to pacify yourself and sell X amount of dollars a year, then great. You don't need a coach. But if you have aspirations to grow your business, that's where a coach can hugely benefit you folks.